Looks to be that way. So... Do I do anything with this? No. I guess I'll just go up the stairs. That's all for decoration. It's a window over there. Not a fancy door. Oh, here we go. Oh, cool! It fills up the little disc thing. That's pretty freaking badass. I like it. Oh right, we're going to have a boss fight in here. I <laughs> I totally spaced out about the boss fight. Oh dear. Hi, Serena. Good of you to join us. This would be a good time to save the game. Alright. So we gotta find this guy who's gone all evil. These Falmer are they're frozen in the ice. I wonder how long they've been like this. Probably for a while. I thought the soul camp was creepy. They've all got nice things though. Whoa shit! Where'd you go? I should have known that was going to happen. Alright, let's loot all these little things, all these little tidbits around this prayer shit statue. Um, yeah, I got him. Alright. Reactivate that shrine. What we got over here? Ah, so this is the way we were supposed to go. Got it. This is super creepy. Oh dear. Look at that thing. He's a biggin'. Okay, Serena, don't do anything dumb. Whoa! Frost giant angry, frost giant gonna kill us. Jeez. Ah, uh, ah, uh, ah, uh, ah, uh, ah, uh, ah, uh, ah, uh. ah. We d I did a lot of initial damage to him, that's good. Oh, gee! Whoa! <laughs> Yee! Ah, 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 ah. Oh no, oh no, oh no! He is not amused! Run away! Run away! Shut the door! Oh my gosh. Um, we can't let him regenerate. I have a feeling he's gonna be regenerating. Serena can't even, like, attack him. Ah. Oh. Holy crap. I think I got him, though. Jeez, what a monster that was. What's he got on him? Some scaled horn armor. That sounds pretty cool. I'll take that. Ruby Paragon. Whoa. Uh, Falmer Arrow... Dwarven Battle Axe. Let's give him back something. Um, I don't need this ring, really, but... Scaled Horn Armor. Kind of feel like taking that with me for some reason. I guess I could drink a few of these potions I don't really need. Uh, there's this magic. There we go. Alright. Frost Giant thing. That was... That was fierce. 
That dude was not a happy man. He apparently has been the death of many a person, too. Looking at all of the corpses in here. We shouldn't really have all these stamina potions, come to think of it. Alright. I don't have the required item. Oh, do I need to get a... I need to come back and grab the... Yeah, the jug. Oh. So that closes the door. Okay, so that's the way we're going to end up progressing, I guess, is we have to open and close these things in such fashion. Oh, elven arrows. More elven arrows. Plentiful potions. All of the nice things. Look at them. Um, hmm. Man, I need to get rid of some of this stuff. I don't think I need that, actually. I don't, I don't want that. Um. Let me take that with me. Put it down here. Oh. That doesn't do anything at all. It just raises that. Oh. Wait, wait a minute. Wait a minute. Wait a minute. Wait a minute. I see, so I don't get stuck in here. Yep, I understand. Makes sense. Whoop. Ha, Serena, you're stuck! You can't leave. I win. I beat the game. Serena is stuck. Ha, 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 ha. She is doomed. She will be stuck in there for the rest of her life. Let's grab this. Oop. Oh! What's this thing? It looks special. Silver emerald necklace. What this what's this dude got on him? Just an Owen sword. I kinda don't want to screw with some of these things now. Because um really don't feel like having them attack me. I think if I want the item, I might have to do tango with them. That's probably the way it works. So let's just leave these dudes alone. What you got on you? Mm. Anything good on you? Mm, nope. Hmm. I really want to find the guy in charge here. For a second, I thought that frost giant was going to be him. But I doubt it. I doubt it. Frost giant was just a big mini boss type deal. It looks like we're going to be heading back into caves now. Oh dear. Hmm. Uriel's Chapel. Oh, here we go. This is going to be it. Oh. Yeah, this is going to be it. This is going to be the fight. Can't go that way. Oh, dear. Confront. So that means I need to actually like talk to him or Did you really come here expecting to claim Ariel's bow? You've done exactly as I predicted and brought your fetching companion to me. Oh hi. Wait, is he talking about me? I think so. Which I'm sorry to say means your usefulness is at an end. Uh oh. He's there. He knew I had something. Oh god. Shit's gone crazy. Please tell me I still have beast form. Nope. Only once a day. 
Well, we might have to get through this by the power of our raw wits. Or I might die horribly and we might have to just go do beast form later. I have been poisoned again. This is probably not a good thing. Uh, Soltier? Soltier, do something? Uh, it appears to do nothing. Okay. That's cool. Ah. Uh, <laughs> I've been poisoned so many times. <laughs> no! The bugs are bad. Serena, help me. Like, turn one of them into an undead guy or something. I. This is bad. Yeah. Yeah. Saw that coming from a mile away. Okay. Well then. We know what's going to happen in here, so what I'm going to go ahead and just do is reset my beast form. Because we're going to have to fight all of these things without having the element of surprise, like, at all. Which is going to be horrible, mind you. Nine, eight, seven, six, five, four, three... Two and one. Apparently it got a little brighter in here for a second. Um, okay. Beast form is go. Let's try this again. Now that we know exactly what's going to happen... Hey! Did you really come here expecting to claim Ariel's boat? I came here expecting to kick your ass. You've done exactly as I predicted. I'm ready to go and this time. Your fetching companion to me. Let's start in this corner, actually. Is he talking about me? Which I'm sorry to say means your usefulness is at an end. Okay. Go, go, beast form. I should probably check really quick to see if there's any points I can invest at the last second, even though I'm pretty sure there aren't any. I have maxed all these out, though, so I should be good to go. This should be... should be good. I'm just wrecking these now. Like, it's not even... like, this is a joke. Okay, cool. Got it. I'm gonna wreck it! I'm gonna wreck it! I could have almost feasted on that one. He just exploded too quickly. Alright. Eh! 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 <laughs> Get back here where you think you're going, little naked thing. I don't think so. Hey! Maybe I can feed off. Ah, oh, crap. An impressive display, but a wasted effort. You delay nothing but your own deaths. Eh, screw you, baddie. Watch out! He's pulling down the sea. He's what? That's definitely not a good thing. Oh dear. This is quite bad. This has gone on long enough. Oh jeez. Whoa! What the hell? This is crazy. And I can't drink any potions or do anything about this. Oh, this is nasty. Uh, uh. Can I just fear them or something? 
Oh god, I think I need to just run. I, I, I think I might actually just need to just run. This is a very bad situation. At least I feared all these dudes, so I can just pick them off over here, but god. Okay, 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 I'm shifting back. Good. Whew. Okay, drink. Drink, drink, drink. Um, I need, I need, I need, I need healing. Heal. I need also... I've got a lot of invisibility potions. That might be helpful in here. Oh god, this was so bad. So much bad. Um, I'm just at a loss for what to do about all this situation. This is a crazy battle. These Falmers just, they don't even, like... Eh. I guess I was getting some good hits on him there. That's good. Alright. Uh, he is luckily stuck in the door. Good. I guess this would be considered the cheap strategy for this entire thing. <laughs> Ghost Beast Swarm, and then when you can't heal yourself, run away! Oh, oh god. Oh no, oh no, oh no. Shaman bad! Die! You sidestep my arrow, you son of a bitch. Like your spinning foot there, that was no. nice. Wow! Are you all right? Come on, we can do this. I know we can. He's up there on the balcony. Come on. Can I just take a breather for a second? <laughs> Oh my god. Okay. Not just not just a breather. I want my beast form completely back for this. For fighting this guy. And then quick save. And then a pack of Cheetos. Whew. Ugh. Ridiculous. Okay, well, now we're back. Oh, this is all boss fight territory up in here. This is about to get fierce. Enough, Arthur. Give us the bow. How dare you? I was the arch curate of Ariel, girl. I had the ears of a god. That's kind of gross. Until the betrayed corrupted you. Yes, yes, we've heard this sad story. Gelibor and his kind are easily manipulated fools. Look into my eyes, Serana. You tell me what I am. You... You're a vampire? But Ariel should have protected you. The moment I was infected by one of my own initiates, Ariel turned his back on me. Oh. I swore I'd have my revenge, no matter what the cost. You want to take revenge on a god? Ariel himself may have been beyond my reach, but his influence on our world wasn't. All I needed was the blood of a vampire and his own weapon, Ariel's bow. The blood of a vampire? Ariel's bow. It was you? You created that prophecy? A prophecy that lacked a single final ingredient. The blood of a pure vampire. The blood of a daughter of Cold Harbor. You were waiting all this time for someone with my blood to come along. Well, too bad for you. I intend on keeping it. Let's see if your blood has any power to it. Oh dear. Well, we knew it was going to come to this. Uh. 
You need to get away from my friend, man. We've been through a lot. <laughs> yeah, ragdoll effect. <laughs> nice. Woof. Bark, bark. All right, let's get this thing to wear off. I'm very happy that I went beast form. That was that was very awesome to just knock him over and then claw the shit out of him. Oh, it was amazing. All right, let's go ahead and go back and put on wielding. Man, he was weak sauce compared to the, all the other stuff we had to come across, but in werewolf form, just stuff just dies. The only problem is trying to heal yourself when you end up breaking everything. Ancient Fall Mercurus? Oh god, he's got nice things on him. Uh, we need to drop some stuff off if we're gonna take all this with us, though. Let's take... Uh, da, 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 da. Let's leave... Actually, yeah, let's just leave some stuff. Um, this arrow... We don't need any... Ooh! Mmm! This is actually hard. I gotta make a decision here. Um, let me just check out my ingredients really quick and see if there's any that I can quickly figure out. And just move around some inventory space. Giant's toe. Hog beaks. Alright, that's enough. Cool. Cool! All uh, right. So we have an Elven Dagger of Blizzards, which I'm going to equip. And I'm also going to equip this. So that's going to be in my main hand now. Oh, that actually tells you if it's poisoned or not. Cool. I didn't even realize that. Nice. All right. Look at my daggers. My daggers are amazing. They can kill everything and be resisted by vampires. Hello. So the deed has been done. Yeah, we killed him. The restoration of this way shrine means that Vertha must be dead, and the betrayed no longer have control over him. Pretty much. The betrayed aren't to blame, though. What? What are you talking about? He was a vampire, and he controlled them. A vampire? I see. Uh, that would explain much. Deep inside, it brings me joy that the betrayed weren't to blame for what happened here. Why? Because that means there's still hope that they might one day shed their hatred and learn to believe in Oriel once again. It's been a long time since I felt that way, and it's been long overdue. My thanks to both of you. You're welcome. You risked everything to get Oriel's bow, and in turn, you've restored the Chantry. I can't think of a more deserving champion to carry it than you. If you wish to learn more about the bow, or obtain some hallowed arrows for it, I'd be more than happy to help. You've but to ask. <laughs> Oriole's bow added. Nice. Let's just check out this thing. Oriole's bow. I mean, this is easily going to be my new weapon. 20 points of sun damage! Undead targets take triple damage! Dear God! Does it ching, sparkle, sparkle? Kind of does. It's not as shiny as I was expecting. Still, it's beautiful. Yes, it is. Shininess be damned. Alright, um, sun hallowed arrows. Oh, the sunburst in here. Oh, cool. How do I get more arrows for this? It's good to speak to you again. What will happen to the Chantry now? Why it would fill me with joy to see the Chantry back to its former glory. That time has long since passed. Now that my brother's dead, it's quite possible I'm the last of our kind. Then I've been contributed to your kind's extinction. There's no need for that kind of talk. I said it was possible. 
It's also quite possible that there are some other isolated conclaves of Snow Elves nestled elsewhere on Nern. I'll also assume Vertha didn't exactly give you the option to stay your hand. What will you do then? For the time being, I will remain here on the Overlook and continue trying to keep the Sanctum free of the betrayed. You're always welcome to return here at any time, of course. What can you tell me about Oriel's bow? The bow was said to be carried by Oriel himself into battle against the forces of Lorcan in ancient and mythic times. Its craftsmanship has no equal anywhere within Tamriel, and possibly beyond. What can it do? The bow draws its power from Aetherius itself, channeling it through the sun. Hey. Therefore, when an arrow is loosed from the bow, it produces a magical effect very similar to being burned by fire. Sounds powerful. That's actually only a fraction of its potential. With sun-hallowed arrows, you would be able to produce a much more spectacular effect, causing bursts of sunlight to envelop your foes. The sun bursts would certainly hurt anything, but is especially devastating to the undead. So Verther said something about using blood? Well, using an arrow with the bow that's been dipped in blood may cause it to function differently, corrupting its purpose. That's, of course, if you're foolish enough to try it. So can the Betrayed ever be cured? I feel nothing but sympathy for the Betrayed, despite my actions against them. But I'm afraid that they're well beyond a cure at this point. Why? The twisted forms you've seen didn't occur overnight. It isn't a plague or a disease that ravaged our species. The Dwarves may have stolen their sight, but it took many generations for them to become what they are today. Then there's no hope for them. Perhaps they'll never return to their former appearance. But over the centuries, I've noticed a rise in their intellect. If a line of communication could be established with them, maybe they can find peace. It's the only way they'll discover that they weren't always malignant. They were once a proud and prosperous race. How do I obtain sun-hallowed arrows? I can actually assist you in that regard. If you were to bring me some good quality elven arrows, I could imbue them with the proper incantations and rituals. Can you make me some? Absolutely. I can only do 20 at a time. So if you want the rest of your arrows blessed, let me know. Nice. All right. Absolutely. I can only do 20 at a time. Certainly. I can so only he do 20. just I'm afraid keeps... I'll need elven arrows if you want me to produce the sun hallowed arrow. All right. How many freaking elven arrows? Okay. Jeez. I have 71 of the things. All right. Awesome. And that they appear to be extremely powerful. So along with Oriel's bow, I think I can do it some severe damage to the undead now. It's not as shiny as I was It's plenty shiny, Serena. Jeez. Okay. Shine of sight. All right. Let's check really quick and see what we have to do next. But I'm pretty sure we're getting close to a very good stopping point. Speak to Serena. Yeah, well, let's go ahead and do that. Serena, what do you need? It's not as shiny as I was expecting. You said that like ten times. Still, it's beautiful. Okay. So what do we do now? I think we both know. It's time to face my father. If we don't, he'll keep chasing us for the rest of our lives. If we do, he'll have to die. Hmm. Maybe we can reason with him. Well, she's kind of right. We can't really reason with him. Um. Because he's just basically gone crazy. I've been thinking about this for a long time. It's... It's not easy. But I don't think we have much of a choice. No, this has to end here and now. Then let's face him together. If we head back to the castle and kick the front door in, we're gonna be knee-deep in his friends. Let's head back to Isran and let him see what we've got first. I'm betting he'll lend us a sword or two. He probably will. He's probably gonna have a field day when he sees this thing. Jeez. Um, well, I'm gonna save the test firing of this thing for next time, guys. Uh, until then, it has been a whale of a time. Oh, I had a feeling that we were going to be up here. Yeah, look at all those things.
those big holes the dragons made. Anyway, yeah, quite a pretty place. That was a fun little quest adventure, and it looks like next time we might actually be wrapping up Dawn Guard. So thank you for joining me and coming along for the ride, and I will see you all in the future.